Hey guys, so it is Saturday today and I'm go on my way down to get Welbeck because we're going to a show. Um, we're going to Calvin today and we're jumping the 120 and 130. I'm of course running a bit behind because I tried to um, lunge or ride a horse before. So I lunged, um, what's her name? Fuck it. I lunged Starlight. Oh, wait, the gate now. It is such a nice day today. Blue skies all around, very different to the last day I vlogged, which you probably saw yesterday. That was Thursday and then today's Saturday. Um, but I'm jumping indoors anyway, so it doesn't actually matter. Um, so yeah, I'm just going dead right now. Luckily, she isn't miles away. She's actually in the first field for once. So yeah, I'm really excited. <laughs> um, anything else I need to say? Don't really think so. Uh, just coming up on her now. Here they all are. Here's all the gang. Hey guys. Oh, looking. They always look so much better when it's sunny. They're all shiny and everything. It's nice. And there's Webeck. And Indy. I want to sidetrack me to get the feed. So here she is. I'm also wearing my show shirt because it is so hot that I couldn't wear my jumper. Like, I was just sweating. But it means it's going to get so dirty. But it's your look. Yeah, worst things. Hey girl! My Webeck is all clean and shiny. I'm gonna take a little picture for my Facebook, I think. In the sun. Good girl. Oh, she's so shiny. So, do people still do like outfits of the day? I like don't know, but okay. Uh, this is Kingsland. This is uh, Forever Oak. And my boots are Mountain Horse, which I've actually cleaned really well for once. Um, yeah, I'm proud of myself actually. So I'm just waiting for my dad to drive down uh, with the horse box. While Beck is looking all pretty. Yes. Yeah, good girl. I'm here in Calvin now, and I'm just waiting for the 110 to be over. There's only like 15 left in it, and then I'm gonna go and walk my horse. Hey. <laughs> I jumped to the 120 and we had just the first fence down. She just rode it with her back legs, which was pretty unfortunate, but she did jump very well. I was really happy. So I'm excited for the 130 now. Just then it was so embarrassing. Oh, I'm gonna get copyright strike on this music in the background, so bye. Yeah.
around the back. Maybe around the back. Hey guys, so we are home now and it was a very good day. Um, well, the 120, obviously I was pretty disappointed just jumping over the first fence and I knocked it and I was like, that kind of sucks, especially because it was a bigger show. So if you knocked in the first round, um, some shows let you just do the second round anyway, but they weren't. So I only got to jump like the seven fences, which was a bit of a bummer, especially when you come the whole way and like pay your fee and you only get to jump like seven fences. But anyway, <laughs> and then we were waiting so long for the 1.30, I was like almost going to just leave, call it a day and go home because I felt so bad that we were just waiting there for so long and it was such a nice day, it was kind of like we were just wasting it. But I'm so glad we stayed because we had double clear in the 1.30 and she jumped so, so nice. I rode, I rode a little bit differently, a bit more collected, like I was compacting the canter a bit more and I also had a bit more like uh, power a takeoff I just put a little bit more leg on especially because the verticals like in the 120 she just tip the vertical with her back end like she does that Um, that's kind of her if she's gonna knock that's how she's gonna knock she'll just tip a vertical with her back end so to the verticals I get I had her really collected so the jump was nice and round and then it seemed to work because she didn't knock any and the first fence again was a vertical and I was so worried that I was gonna knock it I was just going to this first fence like don't knock it don't knock it don't knock it and thank god I didn't um although like riding like that to a fence you'd think I was gonna knock it because you know when you like override it and think too much about a fence then you end up knocking it anyway yeah anyway I didn't thank god oh that goes so good and it was also moved to the outdoor arena which I really did like um I love riding outdoors compared to indoors even though the arena was actually smaller than the indoor arena it felt bigger just because it was outdoors I don't know anyway I'm so so happy with her um the qualifiers are next weekend next Sunday and they're in Barnadown which is like two and a half hours away which is a pity that's so far away but um because today went so well I'm excited to go on Sunday uh, so yeah, and it's on grass and she really likes the arena that it's on. She did really well the year before last in the qualifiers. We got to like the, we were like two places off qualifying. So yeah, hopefully we um, are no places off qualifying and qualify, yeah! I'm, also, I'm looking at her, I'm not like looking at nothing. So yeah, I'm delighted with today. She was so good. I um, It's like eight o'clock now, so I'm not gonna really get the rest of the horses done. But at least I have all day tomorrow to do them. And yeah. Thanks so much for watching guys. Uh, see you next time. Bye.